The sun was shining and the sweet smell of spring permeated the air as historical icons John Emery and Patrick Henry recently came to stay on campus. Permanently. Two bronze statues of the founders of e &H now stand in front of Kelly Library just down the sidewalk from the recently installed Alumni Plaza. These statues were unveiled on Founders Day in front of a crowd containing all levels of the e &H community. The theme of pride was present in speeches made by President Reichard, the statue sculptor, and high-ranking members of the e &H community about this institution 175 years in the making. An alumnus of the college commented on the lack of statues compared to other institutions and that these statues finally distinguish the grounds. Give me liberty or give me death were the famous words of Patrick Henry. Rest assured, it was said that now Patrick Henry is probably thinking, you have given me honor and praise, and I will never die. College around uh, the U.S., uh, some wonderful new work that he... That is probably beyond compare. <laughs> Thanks, Brent. Student government debates took place Tuesday evening in Byers Hall on campus. Presidential runners Mark Robertson, Race Lamb, and Tessa Burden went to head to head with their running mates Yancey Wilmoth, Ashley Eversall, and Kenton Williams. The Robertson Wilmoth campaign website gives promises specific project proposals to improve life on campus and the image, too. The proposals have all been written up with approximate costs and calculated. Lamb Eversall campaign has a Facebook page. Their main focus is Project Swarm, originally started by the former women's head basketball coach. Swarm was originally made to bring students, athletes, and faculty together at athletic events. Now, the Lamb Eversall campaign aims to broaden the swarm by bringing in local businesses, Southwest Virginians, and more. The Canton Williams campaign does not have a website or Facebook page, but has become popular through word of mouth on campus. If you're a student, don't forget to exercise your right to vote in the upcoming election. Which campaign do you think is the best? Caron Bio, EHCTV.